Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with 2019 Panini Certified Football. 12 box inner case from a big fresh case right here. This is pick your team number seven. Also, if you purchase at least two teams, right, you'll get one entry for a hundred bucks of break credit. I'm sure everyone read the item description. If you get four, you get two entries, six, three entries. If you get nine, let's well, if you get eight, four entries. If you get nine, still four entries. If you get 10, five entries. I don't think anyone bought 10, 10 teams. But in the event that someone went bananas and did that. All right, a very big thank you to the case right here. That's the case. To these folks right here. On a Saturday, the 27th, pick your team seven. Nick Burton, last bought Mojo Star next to his name. There's everyone else. Thank you. I don't think a lot of people bought two teams. Which which I guess is fine for the people that did buy two teams. Oh god. This guy just gave up a grand slam? Come on, Phillies. I like those old Phillies uniforms though. Is this some sort of retro uniform weekend? I like the old A's or uh, Braves uniforms too. With the lowercase red A. Get out of there. All right. Now let's flip this case around. All right. Here we go. So there's a case on the left side, a case on the right side, and we're going to select a die. Like like that one right there. And we'll toss the die in there. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. It's gonna be six. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're gonna do the right side first. This X marks the spot. We're gonna do that one. And this pick your team eight right there. Which I'm which we could we have time to knock out tonight if we if we rallied around it. We could do it tonight. Uh, we we break seven nights a week, folks. So anything we don't get to tonight, we'll get to next time. Yeah, TJ was guessing three on the dice roll. Close. X marks the spot. Here we go on the break. Good luck, everybody. So this break will take a minute or two. Maybe 50 minutes, 60 minutes. Stacks of four. You can see on the Nick cam right above my head. You can see the stack back there. So everything's on camera. Stack right there. And then you see the stack in the foreground right here that has the four boxes. All right. Good luck, everybody. We're looking for two and two. Two autos, two mems per box on average. Two autos, two mems. All right, first pack, first box. Pick your team seven. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. 
Now nothing is filled up after this. We should have, we should be ready for the next break in about an hour or so. And I know that football mixer is getting close, but that is a long break. So make sure you kind of keep the, uh, keep the time frame in mind. start off with three color patch auto Riley Ridley to 499 David Duffy with that one and just in the interest of time we're gonna breeze by those and we'll uh, whoa we'll sleeve these and we'll top load the hits later 12 out of 15 that's Lawrence Taylor Giants, fabric of the game. That's unexpected. Mark Matheson with the Giants, LT. Diamonds to 35. Joey Bosa to 199. And Royce Freeman. Certified gamers to 199. Oh, yes, or everyone's here. There could be points in here, too. Winner take all on the points. Roy Streeman, Oppo Joe Mojo, Nick Burton with the Broncos on the board. I may, that's out of three ninety nine. I may go buy those, but our shipping team will, if I miss any of those numbered cards, our shipping team will track those down, make sure they get to you. Fred Williams with the Cardinals, Hakeem Butler. Let's see if we can find the guy that's going to be throwing him the ball this year. Le'Veon Bell to 450. How do we think Le'Veon Bell is going to do? That's a nice low number right there. 7 out of 10 on the James Conner. That goes to the Steelers' Robert Grease. Le'Veon Bell has a year off. Should be fresh, right? I think first major injury of camp. I don't know if it's major to major to him. Corey Coleman. Who I thought might have had like some some late round fantasy impact, but poor Corey Coleman this year. It's always a bummer when you do that, especially in camp. Like you're all ready to go, spend an off season, hungry for the next season. New team, Giants, I think. Then boom, out out for the year. ACL did the ACL. There's Hunter Renfro. Nice. Great patch. Nice auto out of 499. A lot of great color in these patches for out of 499s. Uh, Hunter Renfro going to Logan and my Raiders. I'm very excited about my Raiders. Hard knocks. There's Andy Isabella. Three color patch and autograph. That is for Fred Williams and the Cardinals. Greg was wondering if anybody has actually redeemed their points for anything cool. There's a couple people in the in the room. Buffalo Bills relic for Jerry Bennington, Devin Singletary, who uh, who do actively collect the points, looking to redeem some like high high numbered thing. They sell on the secondary market too for relatively decent money. Tom Brady one ninety nine because people are are chasing like the hot, the bigger ticket items. There's Juju Smith Schuster to two ninety nine. 
That is for Robert Grease and the Steelers. I know I don't know if they still sell those Kaboom packs, Grego, but I know that for for a little bit they had those Kaboom packs in the reward store for a bunch of points. Maybe is it a thousand points or was it ten thousand points? Something like that. But they would resell for like a hundred bucks a pack, or the hits inside would go for a lot too. At a two ninety nine, Easton Stick, New Generation Relic for TJ and the Bolts. Steve Olson says they don't have any good players you can get for the points. I don't think that's true. You just have to have a lot of points to get the good players. I don't know. I haven't been to the reward store for a while. For a while, they had like Kobe or Blake Griffin autographed like sneakers or something like that. But you had to have like a zillion points for that. But it can be got. Box, good luck. But there is a market for the points. We've we've pulled like a like a nine thousand point card once, didn't we? Like, look up those those huge points, and you'll you'll see you'll see how much they go for. It's a lot more than one would think. All right. This is Brian Burns. New Generation, Justice Hill. That's a catch out of 199. That'll be for Chris and the Ravens. Out of 99, Devontae Adams. Sony Michelle to 450. And we've got, nice, an autograph for the Panthers. Three color patch, an autograph, 26 out of 49, Will Greer. That's for Carolina, that is for TJ, freshman fabric. Ed Oliver for the Bills. DD Westbrook, mirror signatures, two out of five. Jaguars, that goes to Logan. So a couple nice hits there. The Will Greer and now the 2 out of 5, D.D. Westbrook. Logan, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Out of 50, Colts, and new generation Ryan Finley. Yeah, Steve Olsen's like, hey, let's go get that bang. Let's go get the Bengals. Let's go get, that goes to Scott V. Let's go get certified. Eight. The other side, only 11 teams left. We can get that in tonight. We are, we do have time. We got time. What time is it? All right, we got time. We're running out of time. We got time, though. So if you want to get into it, buy early and often. Remember that this, this break takes a chunk of time. And that if we want to get that football mixer in, that will take a chunk of time as well. So if you want to get in, if you want to get more breaks in tonight, start hustling. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Ryan Ruff says he thinks that he heard, oh, AJ Green got hurt in practice. That's not good. Is this, the, is this the last year for uh, for the Red Rifle? Andy Dalton? Are they going to be moving on from him? 
What happened to him? Alright, next box. I got win totals here for you folks. Win total talk. New Generation Relic, Hunter Renfro. That'll be for the Raiders. That's for Logan. There's AJ Green. Immortals, Devin Hester. Immortals, Chris Spielman. Nick Bosa, two color patch and autograph. Nice freshman fabric, 55 out of 299. Chris with the Niners. There's Deontay Thompson to 99. And we've got 19 out of 50 mirror signatures, Morton Anderson. Nice Morton Anderson for Chris. Same Chris, Chris D and the Falcons, the Dirty Birds. Here's Alvin Kamara to 450. And Josh Jacobs, new generation, silver and black patch. 47 out of 99 for Logan. And my Raiders, a little Raider Joe Mojo. Let's try to find his autograph. Out of 299, Mac Wilson. Daniel Garrett saying, boo, Atlanta sucks. Well, Vegas, this is according to ActionNetwork.com, Vegas has the Atlanta Falcons. They won seven games last year, and they have the win total at eight and a half this year. Over, under, Who do you, what do you like, folks? Atlanta Falcons, over or under? Now listen. The, uh, the Falcons had a lot of weird injuries last year. Key defensive players got key injuries. I think Devonta Freeman was out for a year, right? Out for the year. So they were they were an incomplete team. Could they do better than eight and a half this year? Daniel says, "Nah, we ta we taking the NFC South again. We who's we?" Watson, Ben Rothsberger. Ah, Saints third year in a row. All right, all right. Daniel Garrett's a Saints guy. Uh, Saints. Ten and a half wins for the Saints. There's no offense. Last spot mojo strikes again. Nick Burton this time, 75 out of 199, two color patch, no offense. Ten and a half, I don't know. I feel like eight and a half for the Falcons seems a little low. And ten and a half seems a tiny bit too high for the Saints.
There's Anton Wesley, autograph, that's a catch, to 149 for Chris Freeze and the Ravens. I don't know. I'm always worried about Drew Brees suddenly, suddenly looking old. Patriots, Bill Mosher, their win total, they won 11 last year. Vegas has them 11 this year. There's Nick Foles to 199. Here's Baker, superb, to 299. That's for Aaron. Cleveland Browns, they have at nine. I don't know about nine for the Cleveland Browns. At least at this point of the season. I'm a little nervous about, like, you know, new, brand new coaching staff, a lot of new faces on the team. They got to gel a little bit. There's Kyler Murray, new generation relic for Fred Williams. And the next box. You put the Browns at 11 and a half. Or 11, 11 and 5. You think the Browns are going to win 11 games? Oh, yeah, you have no idea like what the coaching is going to look like. They have the pieces for sure. So Cleveland Browns at nine, you're taking Cleveland Browns all day. How, how much money are you putting on that? Or are we putting pizza money on that? Gay Plunker, what's going on? AFC North is trash? Oh, Steelers might have something to say about that. The Ravens have gotten better too, right? And there's Easton Stick. Nice, 210 out of 299. Great color there. Four color patch and autograph. Going to TJ and the Chargers. So you got Will Greer, possible future QB of that organization. And Easton Stick. I think Easton Stick has a better chance, though. Phillip Rivers not getting any younger. Out of 299, Jeffrey Simons. And Antoine Wesley autograph this time. There's a bit of a cracked ice look in the background there, which I think is really cool. Four out of 25 for the Purple Birds. Chris Freeze with the Ravens.
All right. Sorry about that. Okay. I get the mail sorted out. Does this guy get paid? Melvin Gordon, do you pay him? This guy will get paid eventually. Leighton Van Der Esch. This is Neam Hines. Superb Relic, 285 to 299. Raquel Armstead to 399. And Debo Samuel, new, ge new generation relic. For the Niners, that'll be for Chris. All right, next box. Yeah, now, yeah, TJ's got the two rookies he needs. All, all he needs, get the. Christian McCaffrey, that's a trifecta right there. Travis Melberg saying five left in the mixer. Yeah, let's do it, the football mixer, before we run out of time. Sooner the better. Michael Thomas will probably get paid. Does Ezekiel L get paid, you guys? You guys, they kind of have to, right? But will they, should they? They gotta pay Dak, too. And they gotta pay Amari Cooper. There he is, right there. Go visit the Cowboys. I've always wanted to. I've never, I've never gotten around to doing that. Actually, it's a bit of a hike from here, but, but it's definitely close. Definitely, you know, closer than San Diego, maybe. Or actually, not anymore. The Chargers used to have camp at. They had it one year at UC San Diego, which was pretty fun. I would love to go to Napa. I, I would, uh, I would uh, take a hot air balloon to to Raiders camp. Bill Mosher, you wouldn't pay a running back. Would you pay this guy instead. But see, the thing is, you can't go if you're the Cowboys. You can't go the season, go through us like any part of the season without Ezekiel Elliott. Marquez Valdez Scantling to two ninety nine. Devin Bush three ninety nine. Daryl Henderson, new generation relic. Raise the banner, Joe Namath. And there's Earl Thomas, three out of five. That's for the Ravens, Chris Freeze. There you go, Chris. All aboard the Big Head Express. Woo woo! There's Immortals. And Keel Harry, jersey and autograph for the Pats out of 299. Bill saying Bill Belichick never pays a running back and finds the most replaceable player on the field. Mo uh, the running back is the most replaceable player on the field, he's saying. But not every running back is Ezekiel Elliott, though, right? Yeah, maybe the likes of Bill Belichick can get away with it. Can Jason Garrett get away with it? Nine out of twenty-five. Mirror signatures. Bob Greasy. This is this is where uh, this is for the Dolphins. Ryan Redman. This is where New England Patriots fans are spoiled. Yeah, with Belichick. He just finds guys, makes it work. Surely everyone, but the, the, Belichick's clearly at another level. Yeah, Belichick can do that. You know, it also helps when you play it. Yeah, go. It also helps when you're playing like 
the Dolphins, and the Jets four times a year. You know? With a competent team, you can beat those teams for the last however many years. By then, yeah, they find the yeah, you have sixteen weeks to find a running back and develop one throughout the season. Yeah, you have one sufficient enough to win you a Super Bowl. Or five. Yeah. I think yeah, I think you guys have to, Grego. I think you're right. You gotta feed him, pay him, move on. Just gotta get it done. Let's not let it drag and Buffalo too, right. Six wins right there a season. Automatic. Yeah, six game head start. Six win head start. Redemption. Juan Thornhill to 399. And there's Nick Chubb. Mirror signature, 7 out of 15. Nice one for the Browns. That's for Aaron Salinas, Cleveland Browns. There you go. We got Darius Slayton to 199 for the New York Football Giants. Mark Matheson. There's Eli Manning to 99. And Matt Ryan, fabric of the game to 299. Chris with the Falcons. All right, so Rich Schmidt, I think, was saying that that Argonaut is sold out. Check, it is. So let's get that onto the schedule. How are we doing on time here? Yeah, I'm making decent time. Deontay Thompson, 399. Kenny G, to 25. The Hall of Fame game is next weekend, isn't it? Nick Foles, to 450. AJ Brown, new generation for the Titans. That goes to EA. And the redemption is Benny Snell Jr. Freshman Fabric Mirror Signatures Red. What is that number two? Uh, that's for the Steelers. That's going to go to Robert Grease. Four boxes to go. We're almost there. You know what I think is going to be interesting? I think the Jaguars are going to be interesting. Jaguars. Their win total is set at 8, according to ActionNetwork.com and wherever they got their line from as of a couple days ago. I think two years ago, they shocked the world. Saxonville, all that jazz, right? Great defense. Bortles was playing decently, blah, blah, blah. And then they kind of was not, not good last year. I think I think they're gonna they're they're gonna circle, but they're gonna swing back into being good this year. And Nick Foles is a pretty competent quarterback. Definitely better than Blake Bortles. I think they can win like nine games. Jacksonville is gonna be good. Colts, where are the Colts at? They got it. They got Colts pegged at ten wins. So where are the Texans then? Texans at eight and a half wins. Interesting. I mean, 
healthy Andrew Luck. After a barbecue and football next weekend, Grego, is that what we're, what we're gonna do? That'd be fun. We can we can put a we can put a nice grill in the parking lot. There's Pat Tillman to three ninety nine. What are you what are you gonna make, Grego? What's on the menu? Yeah, August 1st, 2019. So that would be exactly next, uh, oh, next Thursday, sorry. Hall of Fame game is a Thursday game. August 1st. We can still take the day off. There's JGR Siegel Whiteside out of 499. Four color patch, an autograph. Eagles, Aaron Salinas with the fly, Eagles fly. Some ribeyes, cold brews. I like the sound of that. Kind of hard to see right there. There's Alex Barnes to 50. And the juice, OJ Howard to 149. That is for the Buccaneers. That goes to Ron Holland, who won that spot in an 8x10 break yesterday. Two, yesterday? Two days ago? It was recent. I can make some, uh, I can bring some, uh, some of Joe's world famous pesto burgers, Grego. Some delicious patties, meat patties with a little bit of uh, pesto infused inside there for. A little kick of flavor. Out of 299, Derek Carr. No worries, Ron. Derek Carr for the Raiders. Slogan. Maybe make some of my world famous guacamole. Bring, I'll bring some of that over. It's Alex Barnes again to 199. New generation, Nikhil Harry to 199. Barry Roberts saying three left in the mixer. Let's get the yeah. Let's get the mixer on the schedule, you guys. We're only three boxes away from finishing this. Then we got Argonaut. The sooner we can get that mixer done, right? The sooner we can get maybe another break done. What else is close after the mixer? I think in case six sold out too. I don't know if that was before or after Argonaut, so we'll have to go through orders. But but even after, even with Argonaut and encased, we can get to the mixer and then still have a little bit of time left to do something else. And that and that would probably be. I mean, even if we don't, and that, that mixer might take us to close to the end. We can squeeze something like a short break and maybe those Fanatics jerseys to close out the night. And then we can call it. <laughs> kind of very. That's a, that's a nice sentiment. But uh, it's like buying a team in 21 boxes. But well, you can you can think of it that way too. Miles Sanders, four color patch and autograph to four ninety nine. Yeah, I think that in case six is sold out too. I'll have to go through these orders and see what's on tap. Julian Love to two ninety nine. Keanu Neal, thirty six out of ninety nine for the Dirty Birds. That's for Chris. No, check that Chris D. I almost said Chris Reeves. Different Chris's. Well, if the certified sells out before the mixer, then we would have time for certified. 
It's AJ Green, Jarvis Landry, 25 out of 50, Cooper Cup. But we break seven nights a week, ladies and gentlemen, so whatever we don't get to today, we'll get to tomorrow. Aaron with that one. There's Karen Higdon, 225. Daniel Jones, to 299. Two boxes to go, folks. We're almost there. We're getting there. Wow, Phillies are getting smoked. 14 to 1 in the top of the fifth. Hi, Jack. What's going on? And Mixer is sold out. Nice. If you had an autograph of former... An autograph of former... Of a former AP. Oh, that link is just incorrect. Ignore the link. I'll update that link. But it'll be the the former, the Associated Press NFL Offense Rookie of the Year. All right. And Mixer is locked in, folks. Nice. Um, if you look on the, if you look in the chat, there's the schedule right there. Yeah, Argonaut sold before the mixer anyway. It's it would be first to fill, first to break, Bill. So if it happened to sell after the mixer, it would it would have gone after. Two color patch and autograph, Debo Samuel to three ninety nine. That's for Chris and the Niners. Ed Oliver to 25. So I'll go through orders after we clear this break away. There's Javon Kirsch. 41 out of 60 for the Titans. Mirror Signatures EA. Nice. 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 The commercial. Tyler Boyd, 63 out of 99, certified gamers. That goes to Scott and the Bengals. New generation, Benny Snell for the Pittsburgh Steelers. There's Garoppolo to 450. And the last box, ladies and gentlemen, we did it. Now we're going to get this in just under, just about an hour maybe, just under an hour maybe. Maybe I got to do a quick recap too. All right. Good luck, everybody. This is Certified 7. We've got Certified 8 in the store right now. Pick your team at number 8. 
Not entirely. I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to... Uh, whatchamacallit? Go through orders. I don't think we're going to have time for a certified 8 tonight. But we do break 7 nights a week from 2 o'clock LA time to 10 o'clock LA time. So... Should be able to do it tomorrow. Yes, the mixer has sold out, Dave. Yeah, so we're going to get that on the schedule soon after this box. Um, no, Bill. Here's the problem with doing probabilities of a hit. You don't know what's going to be in every box. So if you really want to try to find out the probability, it's pretty difficult. But if you really want to try, you could try to count all the hits in each box that we have listed on the item description. Right? And then if you, if you suppose that every team gets an equal distribution of hits, which they won't. But if you suppose that, then you can probably figure out what one team could possibly get. All right, there's no fan. That's a catch to 199. And that's going to go to Nick Burton, last spot mojo. All right, there's my homies to 99. Do you think that jersey break's going to happen tonight? Yes. That is short. I think we can we might we should be able to squeeze that in tonight. At a 299. Tony Pollard, Cowboys. Freshman fabric right there. Whoa. Should we go to Tony Pollard's barbecue restaurant? There's Ja'Kai Pilot to 35. There's Darnell Savage Jr. What a savage. Out of 149. Packers, Mike Cody on the board at the end. And that, my friends, is that. Let's give away some money. All right, so if you bought at least two teams, as stated in the item description, you will get one entry. You buy four teams, two entries. Six teams, three entries, so on and so forth. Aaron got four entries, or four teams, so he gets two entries. Chris got two, he gets one. David got one, or two, he gets one. Derek got two, he gets one. Logan got his two, so did Mark. Sam, Scott. And TJ. All right, that's 10 names on the list. Actually, nine names. Aaron has two. Nine names, 10 spots. Pretty good odds to get 100 bucks of break credit. Name on top, two and a two, four times. One, four the hard way. Two, three, And fourth and final time, name on top, is going to be David Duffy. There you go, David. Congrats to you. $100 of break credit going your way. Now, here is the recap video. Once again, there's the list of teams right there. So pretty solid break. Tony Pollard, some nice relics, some great color. Javon Kirst, Debo Samuel for the Niners. I went to Chris. 
couple train whistles in there too. Benny Snell Jr. relic or uh, redemption that is. Nick Chubb, and we'll have all these top loaded, of course, before they're sorted and shipped out. Just trying to save time on a break that's a little long. And Nikhil Harry, train whistle on that Earl Thomas, Ravens edition. I like these kind of cracked ice patterns in the background right there, 25. Antoine Wesley, Easton Stick. Some nice relics, Antoine Wesley, another autograph. Morton Anderson, Nick Bosa, D.D. Westbrook to five. Got Will Greer as well. Some nice relics. There you go, that's Andy Isabella. Hunter Renfro for my Raiders. Keem Butler. Lawrence Taylor, very early on in the break. And we started off with a Riley Ridley. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Certified number seven in the book. Certified eight in the store. Check it out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. And we'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.